Hello, and thank you for purchasing Bachmann's exciting new Spectrum 280 outside frame narrow gauge locomotive. You know, real railroads knew the importance of good locomotive care and maintenance. That's why they built roundhouses such as this one to aid in servicing their iron horses. Even rugged iron and steel machines like these required regular lubrication and cleaning. Without locomotives, the trains couldn't run, so the railroads treated their motive power with tender loving care. And likewise, with proper care and attention, your new Bachmann 280 will give you a lifetime of service and pleasure. This engine is the latest entry into the Bachmann line of award-winning, state-of-the-art, large-scale locomotives. The Spectrum outside frame 280 is a precision 1 to 20.3 scale model with many of the same features and details found on the prototype, including, of course, its unique outside frame and wheel counterweights and Baker valve gear. Other features include complete backhead detail, featuring steam gauge with piping, throttle, fittings and operating firebox door, Johnson bar and linkage, cab windows and doors, pop valves and bell with metal clapper, whistle, metal handrails and piping. Other Bachmann Spectrum 280 locomotive features include LEDs in the firebox for realistic fire glow, an LED headlight, and an operating smoke unit with on-off switch, and a polarity switch for your convenience. A close look around the locomotive will reveal lots of additional details, including sand lines, pilot beam with nuts, bolts, and washers, chemically blackened machined metal wheels and fully detailed tender trucks with brake beams, hangers and shoes. Its scale to prototype construction features a metal frame with sprung metal axle bearings and realistic suspension system. We spent thousands of hours working from drawings and pictures of actual locomotives to painstakingly reproduce every last detail. The result is one of the most realistic models on the market today. The Bachmann Outside Frame 280 is powered by a precision 5-pole can motor, coupled to a heavy-duty driveline and gearbox, and a first for large-scale model railroading. The Bachmann 280 includes a polarity switch. This additional feature will give you the flexibility of choosing either the NMRA NEM polarity standard or the polarity used by other large-scale manufacturers. Did you know that the 280 locomotive type was often called a consolidation? Did you ever wonder where that name came from? Well, let's take a look at the role of the 280 in American railroading, and along the way, we'll find out. In the 1830s and 40s, the fledgling railroads in the United States began to build westward to tap the vast resources of the American frontier. These early efforts at expansion soon ran up against the imposing slopes and deep river valleys of the Appalachian mountain range. The steep track grades and twisting roadbeds necessary to cross these formidable barriers heavily taxed the railroad's small motive power. To meet the need for more tractive effort, the locomotive builders of the day began to design and construct larger and heavier iron horses. This in turn led to the use of lead trucks and more driving wheels on locomotives so as to spread the heavier locomotive weights more evenly over the lightly built rights of way. Lightweight 420 and 040 locomotives were quickly replaced by 440, 260 and 080 engines. In 1867, the first locomotive with a 280 wheel arrangement was built by the Baldwin Locomotive Company for the Lehigh Valley Railroad. It was named Consolidation in honor of the recent merger or consolidation of several railroads to form the Lehigh Valley. The design quickly proved to be very successful and was soon copied by other railroads across the country. In fact, the 280, or Consolidation, became one of the most popular locomotive designs of all time. Over a 70-year period, thousands of them were constructed by almost every builder of locomotives. The 280 design was built in a variety of shapes, sizes, and track gauges. 
They were used in all types of service, freight, switching, industrial hauling, and they even worked regularly on local passenger trains. Consolidations were the go-anywhere, do-anything, maids-of-all-work workhorses of the railroad industry. They were used around the world on standard gauge, narrow gauge, and even broad gauge railways. Bachmann Spectrum 280 is a model of a Baldwin locomotive works stock design built in the early 1920s. Baldwin sold these modern outside frame vest pocket 280s around the world. Over the years, Baldwin and other builders exported hundreds of 280s to Mexico, Central America, South America, the Philippines, India, China, and other countries. In fact, many of these engines are still in operation today in Cuba and several other Latin American locations. Outside frames were used on many modern narrow gauge locomotives to help spread their heavier weight over a wider loading gauge. This allowed for a lower center of gravity and more stability on narrow gauge track. On the Bachmann Spectrum 280, we have modeled this unique prototype feature faithfully right down to the outside wheel counterweights. We feel that it adds to the teapot with character appearance of the model.